This is the Moplay Smart Electric Drum Set. What makes this drum set unique is that it comes with an app that you can install on your Android tablet or your iPad, and then you can play the drum set like a game. It's basically like Rock Band, but with a real electronic drum set. In this video, I'm going to go over the setup of the drum set. I'm going to talk about how the app works. And I'm going to talk about kind of my overall impressions with the drum sets and a few things that I think can be improved. Before I get started, there are a couple things I want to bring up. The first is that I am not a drummer. I've been playing this for about two weeks. So all of the footage you see of me playing this drum set, just keep in mind that this is me playing for two weeks. The second thing I want to mention is that MoPlay is sponsoring this video. They sent me the drum set so that I could do an evaluation. So I would like to thank MoPlay. I've, I've actually really, really enjoyed this drum set. This has been a lot of fun so far. The overall setup with this drum set is really pretty simple and basic. Everything comes fairly compact in a rather small box. A lot of the drums are already assembled, but a lot are not. And so you will have to take some time to assemble everything. It took me probably about an hour just to put things together. For me, and I think this is probably because this was a test unit, I didn't have any instructions or anything, so I just kind of set it up on my own, but it was easy enough to figure out that I didn't really have any problems. I did have to make a couple tweaks after the fact to correct some things that I did wrong just to make it more stable. And I put the tablet mount and the controller in opposite positions of where I needed to, so I needed to switch those up. But overall, it was really easy to set up. And the drum set does come with its own earbuds that you can use, and it came with a MoPlay amp. You can use the earbuds if you don't want other people to really hear you playing, or if you want to broadcast to the world how awesome you are, you can use the MoPlay amp, and it does get quite loud. As far as the overall play of the drum set, now I have played on a real actual drum set a handful of times in my life, and there are some obvious differences, but overall the, the rebound on the drum pads and everything like that, it feels good. Even with the cymbals, you can hit the cymbals and then you can put your hand on it to dampen it and it reflects that in the sound. But there's other kind of intricacies of a drum set, of an acoustic drum set that you can't really do on this, like rim shots or kind of changing the sound of where you hit it. Now it does have uh, pressure meters or velocity or whatever you want to call it, where if you tap it very lightly, the volume will be low. And if you tap it harder, it gets louder. So that's actually pretty cool. And it plays really close to what an acoustic drum set is like. Now I kind of want to go over all the features of the app. When you first open the app, it will show kind of the, the new improvements or some of the additions for the month. And I must say that looking at this, they are actively updating this quite a bit. I think about once or twice a week I've been seeing improvements. So that's a good sign to know that MoPlay is actively developing the app to make it better. The app has arcade mode, which is basically kind of like the game Rock Band, where you have a song and you play along with the song, and then at the end it gives you a score. It also has a practice arcade mode, and this is the same thing, only if you miss a note or if you miss a drum, the music completely stops until you actually hit the note. Another mode that the app has is study mode, and this is fairly similar to arcade, but instead of an actual song, it's more or less just drum beats or drum patterns, so you can kind of work on the muscle memory for getting these beats and patterns correct. And then it has practice study as well. Again, it's the same thing, but if you miss a note, if you miss a beat, then it will stop completely until you get it right. And finally, there's a lesson mode. And in this mode, it just gives you drum lessons. So in my time playing this drum set, I found that the arcade mode is indeed a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun to play along with songs. But I found that the study mode for me, because I'm a beginner and don't know what I'm doing, this was a lot more beneficial. When I had practiced, I would practice in study mode so I could kind of get that muscle memory going and just get in the feel of playing the drums. 
And then when I was done with practice, I'd play a few songs on the arcade mode just to have a bit more fun. As far as normal mode and practice mode goes, I used to really think that practice mode was best for me. So like if I missed a note, it would stop and then it would force me to get it right. And so I could keep playing till I get it right. But I found that because I'm a beginner, it really kind of tripped me up and it was really hard to get back on the beat. So recently I've gone back to just normal mode where if I mess up, the music keeps going and I can just kind of hop on whenever I can. This has been helpful to me just to kind of learn the drums and it's not hindering me and stopping me or anything. The last thing I want to mention about the app is that the songs that are on the app, they do have some free songs, but most of the songs on there you have to rent. You have to pay money so that you can play the songs. Everything that I am showing in this video though, I am specifically showing the free items so you can know exactly what it would be like if you didn't pay any money at all. It's just the free items on the app and there are enough free things on this app that you can still have a lot of fun and learn a lot. Here are my overall thoughts on the drum set. I actually bought a drum set for myself about 15 years ago and I never really learned how to play it. And here's the problem that I had with that drum set. I didn't know what I was doing, so when I went to play, I felt really self-conscious because a drum set is so loud. I knew that everyone in the house could hear me mess up and making mistakes, and I just didn't end up playing it a lot. One thing I really like about this drum set is I can just put the headphones on and I can play, and yes, people can still hear, and you can still hear some kind of banging on the drums. So while it's not completely quiet, it's not a huge distraction for my family. I've played many times when my kids are taking naps and it's been okay. And obviously the real cool thing with this drum set is that the app just makes it so much fun. I've made a goal to practice for 30 minutes a day and I've got a lot of things going on in my life and it's hard to set aside 30 minutes to do something new. But I find because this is so much fun, it hasn't been a problem for me. I've been able to play for 30 minutes every day and I love playing. And there's some days that I end up playing for much more than 30 minutes just because I'm having such a fun time with this drum set. A real big advantage for this drum set, especially for beginners, and you know, that's me, obviously I'm not a pro, I don't know what I'm doing, but I think the real concept with drums that I think is important is just kind of building that muscle memory, figuring out beats, playing the beats so much that you can just do it without thinking about it. That's what this drum set's really good at. It has all these lessons, that just have you doing the beats over and over again. It's fun, you can see a score, you can go along with it. You don't have to think in your head, what are some beats I can try? You have all the information there. I really like that about this drum set. I've always been able to keep kind of just a simple basic rock beat, but now I know more patterns and I can have a lot more versatility with playing the drums. And this is only after just a couple of weeks. Another fun thing that I discovered with this drum set that I think is really cool is that I can open any music app I want on my tablet and I can still hear the music coming from the tablet and the music coming from the drum set. So I can still practice, but listen to music as it goes. This has been fun because I can see what real actual songs are doing on the drums. I can try to copy what they're doing and just play along. And that's been a lot of fun for me as well. Now, I think Moplay is a fairly new company. I think this drum concept is fairly new. And there's a few things that I think could be improved with this drum set. The first thing that's the most noticeable for me is when I play the drums every time, I have to unplug the tablet from charging and I have to plug in the cable that goes to the controller box. Now, the reason I have to do this every time is that when you plug in the USB-C cable to the controller box, it doesn't actually send power to the tablet. So it's not charging the tablet. I don't even know if this is something that's possible to do, but if it is, MoPlay should try to find a way to do it so that you can just leave it plugged in all the time. Another issue I noticed with this drum set is when I turn it on, always the first time when I press a button, it doesn't come on. I have to press the button twice. Not really a big deal, but can be kind of annoying sometimes. Another issue I had is when I got the amp, it only had the European plug. I am in the US, so I did have to find an adapter to start using the amp. And going along with that, a lot of the cords for the amp or the control box, they're kind of short, so I actually had to get kind of an extension cord and plug that into that. 
I wish the cords were a bit longer so I didn't have to do that, but again, not really a huge deal, just a slight annoyance. And the last thing that I think MoPlay should consider as an improvement is honestly the prices for renting a song to play seem kind of high to me, especially if I don't even know how good the song is. I think MoPlay should come up with a way so that you could like demo the song for at least 15 or 30 seconds to kind of get an idea if you like the song before you purchase it or not. An idea for improvement that I have in that kind of same vein is they could gamify it a little bit more so that you could play the drums and it unlocks the songs only as you get a certain score on your previous songs. I think Rock Band or other games do this sort of thing. It kind of encourages you to get to a point where you're good before you can continue to do more things. Overall though, I really like this drum set. The app is not perfect, but I do think it's really good. It's a lot of fun and easy to use. I've only been playing for about two weeks. I don't think I'm good, but I can definitely see that I've been making a lot of improvements within this short span of time. I think the drum set is a perfect way for people to learn how to play the drums. It makes everything so fun. I like that the drum set is lightweight. It's way more portable than an acoustic drum set. So if you want to take it to travel or something like that, you absolutely can. And I fully plan on leaving this drum set set up practicing for a lot more. I want to do a follow-up video to this so I can show the progress that I've made after maybe a month or two. So if you're interested in seeing that, make sure you subscribe. If you have any questions or comments about the drum set, make sure you post that below and I'll do my best to answer them. I will post as much information as I can about the MoPlay drum set below so you can check out the current price. Thanks.